If you haven't already, go and check out me and my fiance's gaming channel. The link will be in the description. Hey guys, it's Fantasia and welcome to another mod review. So this is another mod by Little Miss Sam and this is the Foster Family mod. So this looks really cool. It's actually, there's a lot to this mod. So I'm not going to be reading this whole post. As you guys can see, it's really long. We're just going to like figure it out for ourselves. I'm going to like skim through this just to kind of give you guys an idea of what this mod is about if you haven't seen it yet. Um, basically, this like literally allows you to open up your home as like a foster family home. So you can do it with um, toddlers, children, and pets actually. So I think that's really cool too. Um, you don't have to do it with like Sims. You could have your home just have a bunch of foster pets and you know you're like fostering them and then they can get adopted i think that's super cool so um basically there'll be a household there'll be like a new menu on the phone which will be little miss sam family our foster family network <laughs> so that'll be a new menu and then there'll be several several options there you can register at foster family network um unregister you can check the foster family network for foster kids it just seems very cool so and you can also manually manually check every day if a kid is in need the service is available between 8 a.m to 7 p.m register at foster family network for foster pets and so yeah same thing as the kids but you can register for pets so that's awesome um and then you can check the foster family network for potential applicants uh for an adoption so basically you can check if a family is in search for a foster kid slash pet to adopt um how cool is that i never thought that little miss sam would come out with a mod like this i think this is super awesome this could literally you could make a whole let's play based off this and have this whole storyline going i think that's awesome and i feel like someone could totally make a challenge with this which would also be really cool so yeah um basically you'll have three options call foster family home you can cancel foster agreement you can call formal foster family um, if a kid has been adopted you can call them to check on them if you want to oh my god and you can keep in contact so yeah and then it just explains how this mod works which we pretty much get the idea here so we're gonna just like test it out let me see if there's anything else um, there's an emergency button okay so uh, this is the kind of an emergency button which is only visible in the foster family pie menu if the foster kid slash pet does not get into the foster situation themselves for whatever reason okay so and then as you can see it says foster your family and then here's the new little thing here the little menu and then the on the phone right here um foster family network and then yeah this will pop up so yeah we're gonna go ahead and jump into game and we will test out as much as we can this mod is huge i feel like so we'll do as much as we can and yeah let's go have some fun i'm so excited okay you guys so here we are in game i've used this sim before for uh, like a couple other mod reviews i think um so yeah we're just gonna use her again uh, she was cute i just i don't know i felt like she would have a foster home um it's 5 p.m right now but that's totally cool also i have i went in the gallery and typed in hey jen oh my god it happened again <laughs> all the simmers it's so funny to me like every time i'm recording um they're like all of us are playing sims at the same time like all the simmers <laughs> oh my gosh okay so anyways i placed this house down from the gallery i just typed in a foster home and went to the most popular and i found this and i was like okay perfect um because it has like all these beds and things like that so that's awesome so let's go ahead and do this so let's go on the phone um I feel like there's so much to this and I'm so excited. <laughs> uh, okay, so Little Miss Sam Foster Family Network. <gasps> okay, we're going to probably do the kid one because um, obviously the pets will work the same way, but I'm just like, I don't know. I want all these foster kids in my house. I think that'd be so much fun. Uh, yes, but then like I have certain Sims, like even in my Let's Plays, that would totally open a foster home for pets. So yeah, register at the Foster Family Network for foster kids. Um... Yeah, so we're going to do that. Ooh, this is so cool. Okay, let's do that. Hey, thank you for registering to our network as a possible foster family for kids. Kids, We will contact you if a kid is in need of a foster family. Oh, guys, by the way, I'm in Little Miss. Little Miss. What am I saying? We're, we're doing Little Miss Sam's mod. And then I'm trying to say, I was literally just about to say, we're in Little Miss Sam's save file. No, no, no. We're in Plum Bella's save file. So not her most recent one, but like, the second most recent one because that's just the one i have in my game right now but anyways we're gonna wait um but the reason i went in her save file is because i feel like maybe we'll get some more 
options for foster kids? I don't know. Just because there's already like so many Sims who are living their lives in this save. <laughs> I don't know though. So I'm just going to go ahead and wait. And also actually before, before we do that, uh, what am I doing? <laughs> let's um, go ahead and go to this menu again. And then let's just click on the other one where we can check um, this one here. Check the foster family network for foster kids. I want to see. Oh, whoa. Okay. Uh, we have a child in, in need of a foster family. Are you available to take care of the child? Yes, I'm coming over right away. Sorry. Oh my God. Let's go. So she goes, oh my God. Okay. I didn't know there would be like one. Oh, wait, what is this? Is this the kid? I'm so confused. I don't know. What? No, I don't think it is. I think it's just someone else. Oh my God. What? So we have, hold on. So, I think, I guess she's the foster child. Wait, it doesn't say she is, though. Interesting. Um, but obviously she... Oh, welcome Maribel into her new foster family. Oh, guys, I'm obsessed with this already. What? Oh, my God. Oh, we, have to get a, we have to get a photo. And look at she's so cute. Look at her glasses. Oh, you guys. What is life? Okay, let's get a photo of them hugging. This is too cute. Oh my god. She's gonna be the best person ever to these children. <laughs> All right, so we welcomed her. Oh, now it says foster family. <gasps> oh my god, you guys. Does she have any like, oh, she does. We have a moodlet here. New foster family member. A new foster family member moved in, even if wait what even if it will just be temporary you are having to give fosters a home until uh i think that's meant to say they um until they find a new family <gasps> oh my goodness by the way this is just from another mod i did the babysitting one so yeah never mind that because <laughs> i used her for that one okay so um there should be a new thing foster family uh, adopt fo <gasps> we can adopt her like okay so if you fall in love with one of the kids we you can adopt them oh that's super cool okay so she'll just do her own thing i guess let okay yeah so she's just gonna do her own thing we're gonna get another kid obviously we want to like test this out to the fullest so let's get another one okay so you can cancel foster agreement um we owe bills let's pay those just cause <laughs> let's not get the power shut off while we have all these foster kids. Let's not do that. And then let's, um, look for another child. <gasps> this is like amazing. So could we just end up getting a toddler? I mean, oh, we can't right now. Is there no more kids at the moment? Um, if a kid is, oh, it's past 7 PM. Okay. So, um, what I'll just do is kind of like play for right now and like if obviously if something happens i will go ahead and come back and then in the morning we'll be i'll be back and like uh, just bringing in more kids so this house is literally perfect for this whole foster situation so yeah i'm just gonna go ahead and play um i'll have her get to know her her get to know her <laughs> and then i will come back if anything new happens with her or when we're getting some more foster kids Okay, you guys, so um, there is something here. This is filthy, but basically it's school time and we can tell her to go to school now. So that's pretty cool. And then I'm going to have her clean up and then we will go ahead and check if there's another kid for adoption. I mean, for f <laughs> that needs foster care. Um, oh, I thought we paid the bills. What do you mean? Are you stuck here? Are you glitched out? Let's go ahead and reset her. <laughs> um, so I think she did go to school. Um, so that's good. So yeah, the, you can tell them go to school. That's really awesome. And she's going to go clean up now. And then, yeah, we need to pay the bills because apparently they didn't get paid. So let's, let, let's make sure. Um, okay. No, no, no. Um, we don't need to get the mail. And then, yeah, let's go ahead and go on the phone and got her to get another foster kid which is exciting and i don't know how many we'll get nothing else happened with the kid or anything like that i don't know if there's like a certain amount of time where like another family wants to adopt them i literally have no idea <laughs> so we'll find out as we go um I don't know. We'll, we'll do everything we can. Oh, we can check the foster family network for potential applicants for an adoption. Check in our network system if a potential applicant of an adoption is currently in search for a new family. So, 
yeah we can we'll definitely do that but first let's go ahead and see if there's another kid so let's see okay so we're going and there should be a child then it's the lottery apparently okay you guys so it looks like we got a team this time which is super duper cool so let's go ahead and welcome finnegan into this new foster family um you know what i love about this you don't control them which i think is so realistic and obviously better if you're like having all these foster kids in your house you have to like take care of them but you don't have to like worry about each individual like need they have and like hopefully they'll take care of themselves enough you know what i mean so let's get to know him a little bit and let's share the lottery spirit with him sure and then um let's go ahead and get another foster kid because okay so he's funny because we just need a bunch we need to fill up our household take care of these kids try to get them adopted um so let's go ahead and do this again this is fun like this would be so much fun for a let's play okay so it looks like we still can't there's like none available right now maybe there will be in a little bit because we do have until 7 p.m so what i'm going to do instead is check the foster family network for potential applicants for an adoption um no family is currently in search for of a new family member please check again later or wait until we contact you okay so they may contact us so yeah again i'm gonna probably keep playing off camera and then come back when anything happens this is gonna be definitely a bit of a longer mod overview probably um but i will um cut things out and stuff like that but if you i want to show you guys like how this fully works and i want the different things to happen and obviously this is like a kind of mod where there's like a process so anyways i will go ahead and be back okay you guys so someone is actually by the way i keep getting this um last exception and it's definitely from this mod so keep that in mind because it keeps happening um with this right here so something with someone wanting to adopt one of the foster kids makes this error pop up it just like keeps coming keeps coming so if you guys don't know this happens with mc command center it like lets you know if there's a last exception file which can happen in your game without mc command but basically mc command lets you know that these are happening um so yeah um it's not like something to worry about but if that annoys you because that does annoy me sometimes <laughs> hopefully there'll be an update or something um so yeah i did see um troy if you guys know her on youtube she tweeted about how she was having glitches too i don't know what kind of glitches because i didn't get to see her video um but i don't know what her glitches were maybe it was the exact same thing i have no idea but all i know is that i i don't know i i almost feel like so i had to go on the phone and it said that this person is interested um yeah <laughs> but this was popping up before i did that and i was like hmm i wonder why that's coming up and then i was like maybe a sim is interested in adopting one of the sims and it's making it glitch out i think that's what's happening um because then i went on the phone um to see if anyone was interested and then this came up again so i feel like that's what's happening so it says little miss sam foster family network a potential applicant for an adoption would like to come over to visit you and the fosters would that be okay yes send them over okay so let's see if any glitches can happen with that she is like in the rain we we need to call her over <laughs> call over um okay is she glitched interesting um uh, reset let's see um call over i'm not sure i think she's glitched out and she is a foster kid so that's kind of interesting can i go talk to her let's see um, this is why I do these mod review guys because like I want to know um, how everything works and stuff or like if there's any glitches going on. I keep resetting her. I don't know really what else I could do. Um, yeah, she won't move. So I don't know what's up with that. However, um, what what? Let's see. So this says potential adoptive family. So that's cool. Um, oh my god, this is gonna keep coming up because of the child. <laughs> um ask about living situation and complete adoption for oh that's cool let's ask her about her living situation everything else so far seems to be fine there's just a glitch with this child here so and i don't really know how to fix that like i, I don't know she keeps trying to move it keeps glitching out i'm not sure Ooh, this is cool so i live together so we asked her living situation she has two babies um i assume maybe this is her husband or maybe that's a teenager i'm not sure <laughs> and then a child and a doggy Aw, uh, so it looks like she got her hands full, but she wants to adopt another. Okay, let's see if I can do anything else with her. Like, we need to try to figure out, like, I don't know what to do with this child. <laughs> Actually, here's something else we could kind of see um, to test this mod. Let's go ahead and complete adoption four. 
And then, wait, does she want to, can we just choose who she's going to adopt or does she want to adopt a specific sim? Let's see. I have no idea. Okay, so maybe if we see, if we have her adopt Mirabelle, let's see what happens. Is this going to work or is this going to be a total glitch fest? <laughs> I'm curious. So I don't know if it worked. Oh, wait. Okay, so what did this say here? Little Miss Sam family, uh, foster family network adoption for Maribel is completed. Thank you for all the work you have done to help the fosters. Aw, okay, so this just keeps coming up, though. Uh, is she gonna be able to move? Okay, but she's not her foster child anymore. So, she is adopted. Oh, what's this? Moved out foster family member. A former foster family member moved out to live with their new family. You are happy for them, but sad because you'll for sure miss them a lot. Oh, I love that. Okay, so <laughs> is she going to leave or I don't know? Um, because, I mean, we could have her adopt both kids, but she's still glitched. So does she officially? Okay, so she's not um, in our family anymore. Or in our adopted. See, it says foster family here. So, for this child, it doesn't say that. Former foster family. Oh, my God. Wait, I love that. Okay. So, I, as much as I don't want to do this, I'm very curious. Okay, you guys. So, literally, as much as I hated to do that, I had to do it for the mod review. Like, we have to test this out. I literally just had to delete her. <laughs> like, I didn't know what else to do. I'm pretty sure this sim's fine. And now, let's see if we get that last exception error. Um, I'm also curious if we get, like, another foster child instead of a teen, if that will happen again. I don't know. Um, and then, let's see. So, also... Does she want to adopt both or will she just like leave after a certain amount of time? I don't know. Like, oh, is she leaving? Let's see. Because I don't know if she wants to adopt both kids or... Well, you know what? Let's test that out because I want to see what happens if we have a kid that's not glitched out, you know? So let's go ahead and complete adoption. Um, and then we'll get some more kids and just kind of see if that last exception thing happens again. So let's see if a sim is not glitched and they get adopted will they both leave together i don't really know let's find out okay so it actually looks like she's leaving now so i guess she was just adopting one kid i don't know anyways uh, oh no wait 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 wait. for oh i thought it said former never mind <laughs> fail okay so he's still our foster child so um it's Oh, it is closed. Uh, okay, that's fine. So I don't think there's anything else we can do right now. Okay, so what I'm going to do is just skip again and then I'll come back and we'll do some more stuff. So, so far, I like this mod, but then also there are some like glitches going on. So you guys can kind of decide on your own if like you don't want to deal with that. Maybe don't get this mod. Maybe wait till there's an update or I don't know. <laughs> I don't know if it is glitching with another mod I have. I have no idea. I don't see why it would, especially because it's like a new mod. Like, I feel like it'd be compatible with the mods I have. All my other mods are up to date right now, so I don't know. Um, I just feel like that child was just simply glitched out, and I, it wasn't, it's apparently not just me having glitches with this. So anyways, I'm going to skip, and then we'll do some more foster stuff. Okay, you guys, so we're going to go ahead and send him to school, and then we're going to go ahead and see if there's any more kids, and... Hopefully we get a child so we can just see if the issues with chat with children or maybe just any sim. I don't know. Maybe it was just that sim. I have no idea. <laughs> okay, so let's go ahead and check. Um, all right, so there's another kid. So we're going to go and pick them up and we'll see. Maybe we'll get a toddler this time. I have no idea. All right, so we got a child. So let's go ahead and welcome Nicholas into his new foster family. So, oh, he's cute. Aww. So we'll get to know him a little bit and stuff, of course. And we'll brighten his day. Um, talk about vacations. We can also see if there's any other kids we can get. If not, we can go ahead and see if there's a family that wants to adopt. So let's go ahead and see. Okay, so let's go ahead. Oh, wait, no, we can't. What can't? <laughs> um, so we'll just go ahead and wait, I guess, then. Um, there's also not even any pets. I was going to say, like, maybe I'll test out the pets, but there's not even any pets. So it's fine. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and speed it through. Again, I feel like <laughs> this is so much like speeding through, but I, we got to know, you guys. I need to know if there's any further glitches with this or if that was the only glitch we're going to experience. Because if it's the only glitch we're going to experience, that's not really too bad. But if we're going to have some more glitches well that's not a fun time okay you guys so another thing we can do is call foster family home um 
so we can basically call him home so he finished school he didn't come home um so you can call him home and then he should show up here so that's another thing you could do so that's pretty close so let's see if that works um he should show up hopefully if not we'll try it again but i feel like he should show up um I don't know hopefully he shows up but let's go ahead and call the foster family network again because i have not a little bit let's see if there's any um okay so there is someone interested so let's have you come over um he's still not here though so we're probably gonna have to have oh no wait there he is okay he's been here longer so i just feel like maybe he should get adopted you know the this child just got here today so let's go ahead and see if they want to take him home and adopt him okay so let's go ahead and ask him some questions um i kind of like that he came right over here and sat with us that's a good thing <laughs> so foster family ask about living situation let's do that let's see his living situation so he lives with i believe his wife and teenage daughter um so maybe this teenager would be a perfect fit um oh <laughs> so let's go ahead and complete adoption four and let's see, I, we haven't had any more glitches. I'm actually super happy about that because, I mean, if there's one glitch, that's not a deal breaker to me. I mean, literally, as as much as it sucks, delete the sim and try again. Um, you know, if you're not having another glitch, then that's perfect. Um, oh, she really got to know him, you guys. She's going to be sad. Oh, Okay, we can just go ahead and ask him to leave, so we'll just do that. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> she seems so rude about it. And then I, we should be able to check up on the child. Um, I don't know where you do that. Oh, I don't know. No idea. Can we, like... Well, you can obviously just, like, call him like this and chat with him, but there should be something else. Maybe it doesn't come up right away. I'm not sure. Didn't it say we can, like, keep in touch with them or something? Yeah, I think. Maybe it's somewhere else. I don't know. <laughs> um call foster or call former foster family oh my god and we can just chat with him and check in oh i think that's adorable okay i like that a lot um so we'll check one more time on the phone if there's anything else if not i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here because it looks like everything else is good so so far as of right now i do recommend this but also just be cautious of the potential glitches you may have i only had one glitch some people may get a bunch i have no idea just because this is like a big mod and it's like adding a whole new system pretty much so you could get a bunch of other glitches um maybe like if you have some other mods that are conflicting or some other mods that may be out of date that you don't know are out of date that could cause some issues however all my mods are up to date and nothing should be conflicting to be honest i have less mods in my game than i used to i used to have like a crazy amount i've been like a, a little while ago i got rid of a whole bunch that i don't like use on a regular basis so yeah i guess just like check your mods folder and stuff just try it out if you're having glitches just totally remove it like t like test it out with like a test family or whatever um just to see if you get glitches like that are and like see if the glitches are unbearable or not you know what i mean because my glitch that I had is like I can work around it <laughs> you know what I mean so um yeah yeah <laughs> we can't do anything else on here right now so I'm gonna leave this video off here um oh she looks so mad you so mad girl she's so tense but anyways I really love this mod as you guys could probably see from my excitement I think it's super cool I love that you can do kids or you can do um um can't even think <laughs> you can do kids or you can do pets and then okay my my last thing is aren't you supposed to get paid let me double check what it says for like the whole paying situation okay so i just went ahead and checked and once a week you will get paid um on mondays so um you can make money from this um we could should we skip through okay you know what let's make this a full review <laughs> let's just do it all i'm gonna skip through the days literally just like skip through and basically we're just gonna see if she gets paid for this child here um we'll find out everything's gonna be glitched out i gotta like reset her and everything let's reset him <laughs> uh let's go ahead and speed till midnight we, I, I, yeah so anyways i'll be back on monday i kind of wish it was closer to monday but whatever let me go ahead and fix their needs and stuff and then we'll see if she gets some money on monday she should get 500 for a child okay you guys so we are almost to the point of monday but apparently a little toddler is in need of a foster family so yeah let's go and pick them up 
Oh, so she's gonna go and pick up this toddler and then we actually will be able to see if we get money for the child and the toddler. So that would be interesting to know. Oh, we got a vampire at the door. That's lovely. Let me actually fix your needs because I don't want you to be dying. And I was like speeding through the time. <laughs> Um, and I can't see your needs, so let's go ahead and see the toddler she brings home. Guys, uh, this is the longest I've ever filmed a mod review, I feel like. Like, one single mod review. I know there's, like, a lot of cuts, but this is almost an hour long of footage. Like, it's about to be an hour. That's insane. Oh my god, look at this little bean! Oh my god! Let's welcome her! Oh, we can't. Welcome her. Okay, that's interesting. Huh. I wonder if that... I don't know. So she's not able to welcome her. Okay. I don't know if that's another glitch. I have no idea. But she cannot. So if we can't... Can you meet her? Okay. So you can meet her. See, this is good that we're testing this out with the toddler. Okay, so now she will be welcomed into the foster home okay perfect so i don't know what was up with that but if you have that problem just go ahead and meet them first and then welcome them into your home so then it should work so now is she our yep she's in the foster family perfect um so yeah that's pretty cool so um we do have some toddler things for her and stuff like that so that is good um let's go ahead and just play with her and stuff and then yeah so i'm gonna skip through again and oh we got the money right now Okay, so it just became Monday and we got 5750 Okay, you received your weekly foster uh, service support for Nicholas. And that's a lot, you guys. Like, that's a lot of money. Um, although you only get it once a week. But if you have all these foster kids, it's gonna add up and it's gonna be good. So, that's pretty cool. Um, I personally really like this. I think that's awesome. And... Yeah, this could be so much fun for different stories. So now we can wrap this up here. So <laughs> I feel like this was super long, but I really wanted to show you guys um, if like the money thing worked, wanted to make sure I wanted to know too. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. The link will be down below to the mod. So like I said, I had one glitch. So if that bothers you, if any sort of glitch bothers you with a the mod, then definitely skip out on this one. But if that's not an issue to you, if you just, you know, maybe have a glitchy child and you got to delete them, sadly, <laughs> but then all the other kids are fine, then totally get this mod if you don't mind that. I, I'm going to keep this in my game if I notice any future problems. If I use it in my gameplay, I may take it out for a bit or something until there's like a fix. I don't know. Um, also, you may not experience any glitches. So if you're interested in this mod, definitely just like try it out with the test family just to see how kind of like your game handles it. But overall, I think this is such a cool mod. I, it's so much fun. I think you could literally transform your certain story you're doing with this sort of mod or even if you don't do storytelling and you just like want a sim that has all these foster kids and you can have all these you can take care of all these children and give them homes or pets and that's like the that's awesome um so you guys i hope you enjoyed this mod review like i said the link will be down below and i hope you guys are all having an amazing amazing day and don't forget to leave some positivity down below i love you guys also so much and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys You gotta listen up, listen up There's not a thing that I can't get